Tonight is the last night Ohio Congressman-elect Steve Chabot will spend in the tri-state before heading to Washington, D.C. to reclaim his spot in the House of Representatives. Nine News reporter Sayed Shabir caught up with Chabot to find out what changes he wants to see on Capitol Hill. Sayed? Clyde Chabot's return to Washington is part of this nationwide surge from the Republican Party, and the major change he's after is reducing spending. Congressman-elect Steve Shabbat has been waiting for this day for two years now. It says last night in the tri-state before reclaiming his spot on Capitol Hill. Looking forward to once again serving the people of the 1st Congressional District. It's really an honor. Shabbat spent 14 years as the district's congressman before losing his seat to Democrat Steve Driehaus. I still remember driving uh, a U-Haul truck home after having lost the race and uh, the kind of depressing feeling of coming home after you've lost. But this past November, voters decided to send Shabbat back to D.C. And he says he's ready to make some changes and knows which one he wants to tackle first. Clearly, we've got a lot of problems facing this nation. Um, I think probably uh, the number one has to be the out-of-control spending in Washington, and that's something that uh, I know... I intend to be focused on. They have been spending a lot of money that, uh, and uh, money that you know they're just kind of making up. Nancy Rosenacker lives in the first district and says Shabbat is the right guy for the job. Steve's going to um, work hard for the small businessman and I think that's very important in our country that the small businessman get some uh, representation. Uh, service is really the important thing I think uh, making sure you're doing what you can to help the people here in Cincinnati. Now, Shabbat will head to Washington tomorrow morning and will be sworn into Congress on Wednesday. Clyde.